The conditions of your mind dictate the conditions of your life. It will transform your mindset. I have become intrigued and obsessed with the study of one of the most undervalued, underrated superpowers that exist in our world today. That is the study of the power of the mind. I don't think people really understand the power that they possess on a daily basis. It's a muscle that only needs to be exercised, and once exercised, its potential is limitless. You need to be deliberate with your mindset. Believe that you are in control of your outcome. You are in control of your mind. Things are going to happen to you, but only you determine their effect on your life. Only you are in control of your mindset, and it's powerful. So be deliberate. It's about what you're made of, not your circumstances. See, losers, they visualize the penalties of failure, while winners visualize the rewards of success. What's your mindset like? Are you the type to lose and go crawl in a hole? Are you the type to suffer a setback? Are you the type to suffer a failure and never ever try again? You got to go through it to get to it. You got to understand that there are going to be many circumstances that will require your full undivided attention. You got to go through it to get to it. You have to understand it has to be a unique mindset. Setting a goal and then going beyond it. Realizing that there's work to be done. To challenge your mindset. Because the situation in your life today doesn't need to be the situation tomorrow. You know this to be true. This is your human gift. So maybe it's the right time for new goals. It's the right time to make a plan. It's the right time to become more accountable. It's the right time for change. That's what you want, isn't it? That there are principles to perfection, principles of thought and healthy behavior that guide men and women to the top of every field, principles that go untapped, that give us the winning edge in every arena. If you can see it in your mind, if you can believe it in your heart, and have the courage to speak it, then you can pull it into your reality. That regardless of anything that is around you, that is surrounding you, that is trying to drag you down, you must have the mindset. You must be strong. You must be resilient. You must be driven, and you must be able to take whatever's coming at you, that regardless of anything that is around you, that is surrounding you, that is trying to drag you down, you must have the mindset. You must be strong. You must be resilient. You must be driven, and you must be able to take whatever's coming at you, Change your behaviors, go to the gym, go to the library, shut off your phone, meditate every day, show up differently, actually start to be the person you dreamed of being. But where did that change come from? Run the experiment, set a new routine, change your habits, alter your schedule, wake up earlier, refocus your day, stop wasting time. Do you have the mindset of a champion? Because most people have the will to win. But few people have the will to prepare to win. See, it's the little things done consistently over and over again that prepare you to do the little things that lead to the big wins and the championship rings in the end. Champions, the true champions, never get bored with the fundamentals because they understand that in the key moments, in the clutch moments, it's the fundamentals that will carry them to victory. It's also the heart, it's the determination, it's the will, it's the passion, it's the drive. Have the ability to get up, 
But you can't depend on just your body to do the work. You must understand that it's a mental fortitude that will get you through it all. So many people don't have this fortitude. They don't have this attitude. They have no faith in themselves. If you, you as the individual, can take the first step, then perhaps many more will follow. So be deliberate about your goals. Set the bar high. You need to reach for it. Strive for it. It's you who needs to believe. It's you who needs to push to be the best you can be. That's how you achieve greatness for yourself. That's how you see what you can do. So be deliberate. Choose to believe that the world is for you. Because if you choose to believe the world is against you, then you're right. That's exactly how it'll unfold. So be deliberate. You have to be a visionary. In life, we don't get what we want. We get what we picture. You have to see past the pain of your present and into the possibility of your future. Until you picture it, you'll never experience it. Write it down on a piece of paper. Create a vision board. I don't know what your dream is. I don't know every gift that you carry. But if you set aside a short period of time each morning and each evening where you can listen intentionally to the message, then you can experience life-altering reality. And the moment that I accept reality, all of a sudden, everything changes. If you can picture it, you can experience it. By expecting the best as a way of life, you are preparing yourself physically as well as mentally for the demands of winning. It is time for you to master the conditions of your mind.